Well, hello there, beautiful people. It is me, Jazzy Mac, and I have several work from home opportunities. I've got full time, I've got part time, and I have a couple of other bonus opportunities that are going to be for six figures. So we have a lot of stuff to get into today. I'm really excited about showing you these Southwest opportunities. I think you're going to love them. But first, you know, I have to do my shout out. So let's go ahead and get into it because a lot of you have been receiving multiple, multiple multiple, multiple job offers. And as I've said before in previous videos, this is the September spree. I've been asking you if you wanted a uh, any type of live Q&A with me so you can directly ask questions. So I'm going to give you a little surprise here in just a moment. But first, Miss Jordy said, hey, let me tell you, thank you. I had a baby five months ago and I've been searching for my first work from home job. I've been searching for four weeks. I bought your resume templates, got offers this week, September 14th from William and Sonoma, Sedgwick, Carnival, and interviews with Wayfair and Yelp, which I haven't even completed yet. I still have not made up my mind on which one I'm going with, but thank you so much. This is perfect. While I'm in school and a new mom, you are a blessing. Well, Jordy, you are a blessing because you put in the work. I'm so excited for you. If I count it correctly, that is five different companies. You've gotten three job offers and then two additional interviews with Wayfair and Yelp. Honey, you are on a roll and I love it. I love it. I love it. Congratulations to you on all of these job offers and the new baby. Congratulations to you. And then Jerry said, Hey Jazzy, I applied to one of the positions as a sales advisor work from home. It was available for members only. And I start September 5th. Thank you Jazzy for your help. I purchased the resume kit subscription last month and was able to get a job offer this this month. You are awesome. Well, congratulations to you, Jerry. I'm excited for you. And just in case you all are wondering, yes, I sometimes send out those member only jobs um, that I don't advertise on YouTube. I don't talk about every single job on YouTube. And so that's just one of the perks of having the resume kit. So I am glad that you utilize that perk. Congratulations. And then Miss Dayway said, hey, Jazzy, coming to update you on the Cigna position. I was officially offered the job and it starts in September. Thanks for all your help. I've been watching for a year and finally landed um, at after following the resume templates and watching every video, don't give up, guys. I'm so excited for you. Cigna is a wonderful company. They send you the equipment. They take you through extensive training. I think it's like 12 or 13 weeks of training. So you're going to learn a lot at Cigna. I'm proud of you. Congratulations. And this Miss Monique said, hi, Jazzy. After months of applying, I finally received a job offer from Hotel Engine yesterday for the member support agent. After doing two interviews, I start August 21st and I'm so excited. Thanks for all the content you put out. I thank God for what you do. Much love. Well, congratulations to you, Monique. I am sorry. For some reason, certain comments, I don't see them immediately. So she said this a month ago and I literally just saw this today. So you guys, please forgive me if you ever comment and you're giving me this good news and like, I don't say anything. Like, I am so sorry. Like for some reason, some of these will go into like my little archive folder and then I have to dig them up. So I'm sorry. I I am just getting around to this, but congratulations to you, Monique. And then Deja said, hey, Jazzy, I applied at Nelnet, got an email for a phone interview. They said my interview was amazing. And I received an email from the Cigna position you posted and was sent the pre-screening pre -screening questions to start in September. Thank you so much for all your help. I've been watching for a minute now. Well, congratulations to you. I'm glad that you're starting to get multiple companies reaching out to you. I just love to hear that. And now the moment that you've all been waiting for. Wait, we got one more. Miss Shatara. I don't want to forget about her because she said, I've been following your channel for a while and I just want to say hot words. They are the key. The ATS process is wicked. And if you don't use the same language, um, you're going to gear up for a rejection. So all those pretty resumes found in those processor apps are wonderful, but are absolute trash for ATS. Honey, I couldn't agree with you more. So she went on to say that 
Um, after redoing her resume and replacing it with mine, she ended up getting interviews set up for three different positions at this company. The role that she wanted most, it was paying the most. And she said she was able to utilize and, you know, increase her skills. And she's excited about it. Keep believing. Don't give up. Thank you so much, Jazzy, to responding to us when we had questions and just inspiring us to keep going. Well, thank you for asking those questions. I can't give you information if I don't know what questions you all have. So thank you for asking. Thank you for being open and vulnerable. And I'm just proud of you. So now here's what you all have been waiting for. The live Q&A is happening. Screenshot this, share it with a friend, tell everybody you know, put it on social media because I rarely ever will do anything live, okay? A lot of you have been saying, Jazzy, I wanna talk to you directly. Well, this is the first step. Once we do our live q and I'm going to basically uh, announce something on that Q&A for people that want to talk more directly, but this is what we have going on this Sunday, September 24th at 9 p.m. The link for the reminder is going to be down below in the pinned comments. We are going to go live here on YouTube, okay? So there's no reason for you to miss it. There's nothing you got to download, no emails or anything like that. I'm going to be live. If you go to the link down below in the comments, it has an option for you to set a reminder. Um, so that YouTube will notify you as soon as I go live so that you don't like miss out. And I'm just excited. So the, for the first time, you all are going to be able to ask me whatever you want. We'll talk about these things. I know a lot of you have these burning questions. So this is an event that you do not want to miss. So let me know if you're going to be attending the live Q&A. Comment down below. Tell me if you're going to be joining us for the live Q&A. I need to know who's going to show up. Okay. All right, now let's get into these jobs because I am so freaking excited for you all. Now we're going to come back to the Southwest because I did have a few bonus opportunities. Of course, you all have been asking for part-time opportunities. I have a few of those. This first part-time opportunity is going to be for Jabra. Um, Jabra makes a lot of like equipment, the headsets that you all use when you're working from home are probably made by like Avaya or Jabra. They make um, headsets, but they also make other little um, hearing type devices. So um, that's what they do. And so this particular job is for a part-time customer support coordinator, okay? It is a temporary role. Um, they are looking to hire someone to have them started in the role on October 2nd. And this is gonna run through December 22nd. I've featured this role before and some of the people that did the seasonal role did go on to work full time. They got hired full time with the company. So that is always an option. Now for this particular job, you're going to do things like process order cancellations, returns, you know, things related to the warranty. You might reschedule some customer appointments, things of that nature, because they also do a little bit of um, telemedicine. So this could be related to people that have like um, appointments around like medical appointments. So in addition to the technology piece, there's also a medical piece of what they do, but you don't need to have the experience um, in technology or medicine because they provide you with training. Now, your communication could be done via cases, which is going to be like tickets. It could be done through chats or it could be done through emails. You want to make sure you align with the, with the recruiter to make sure um, you know what your day to day is going to look like because you could also have to participate in some video or phone. So you're not going to do all of these things at the same time. I would just say, hey, am I going to be on a team that is going to be more of phone support? Is it going to be chat support? Is it going to be email support? You can ask those sorts of questions. Those are totally normal. And the pay for this role is going to be 20 to $24 per hour. Okay. Equipment is provided. So this is perfect little part-time job, just in time for the holidays, um, stay at home, mom friendly, all that friendly. So resume templates are um, available in your portal for this role. Now let's look at the next one. 
The next role we have is with wine.com. You all may have ordered wine from this platform, but they're exactly what the name says. They are a um, wine company. They ship wine. I want to say they ship it globally for people that like to buy wine by the bottle or sometimes by the case. So that is what wine.com does. And it says they are seeking a seasonal recommendation specialist to work remote part-time or full-time for the upcoming peak holiday season. So if you are someone that is a wine connoisseur, you know your reds from your whites, your dries from your sweets, you are the person that they're probably looking for. Now, what's cool is they have an online chat platform on Zendesk, um, which we've talked about Zendesk before. So this isn't going to really be a phone's role. You're going to more so be chatting with people. Um, And they are looking for someone to work either a 20 hour shift or 40 hours. So 20 to 40 hours is what they're looking for. And you have to be a um, resident of California, Oregon, Washington, Colorado, Texas, Florida, Ohio, New Jersey, New York, or Massachusetts. Those are the only states that they hire in. So for all the people that are like, what about California? What about New York? Well, here's a job that is hiring full-time or or part-time for this position. Okay. So that is going to be a position that is going to run through January, 2024. And I want to say the pay is up here at the top. It's $20 per hour. Okay. California, New York, and all those other other states friendly, right? Okay. So the next position that we're going to look at is going to be for Southwest. But before we get into um, the Southwest positions, I just wanted to give a very friendly reminder that Southwest has a lot of internal airport positions um, that are everything from customer service agents to they've got services specialists. So a lot of people have been saying, well, Jazzy, I've been working from home for the last couple of years now. I kind of want to get out of the house where people are just like kind of ready to get back into like going into a building. So there's that separation from either kids or whatever else may be going on in their home. So I just wanted to point out there are other jobs out here, like the customer service agent. Um, that you can apply for that aren't necessarily remote jobs because not everybody wants to be remote. Some people miss the people interactions, right? So now let's get into our opportunities. Um, Our opportunities for Southwest, the remote ones are going to be in the technology sector and they are going to be six figures. So I wanted to make sure you were aware of what's available and out there For you all now, I had someone that said, Jazzy, I have a lot of technical experience. Um, They also, you know, had a a big background in things like project management, that sort of stuff. But for my system engineering people, this job is going to be for you. I know this is Dallas um, in the job description, but it also says the remote is fully Um, uh, the position is fully remote, excuse me, with the exception of these locations. So you can't work in like Alaska, Delaware, and all these other states down here. But if you live outside of these states, then you can do this job completely remotely. Okay. This is not any sort of hybrid coming to the office job. This is a fully remote job. Okay. So For all my system uh, engineers out there, you all know that a big part of your job is troubleshooting, root cause analysis, um, implementation for different technology apps or platforms, things of that nature. So they're not asking you to have a ton of specific experience, but obviously you want to have some administrative experience which could look like um, doing like system reboots. You might have to, you know, import different data files. You might have to assist other departments, whether it's for like user access. Um, You could be, you know, again, doing some technical troubleshooting, um, things related to bottlenecks, making sure that the system is not overloaded, making sure that um, apps and memory and all of that stuff is being distributed equally so that you don't bring down the website or bring down any other, you know, platforms that are associated with the airport. So this is a six figure job. 
it's going to pay $112,000 minimum to $125,000. Um, you're going to also be eligible to receive like the yearly bonus. I don't know if Southwest does um, the stock bonuses, but I know they do have like a profit sharing. So if the company makes a lot of money, then they give a portion of that to the employees. So I have seen where some people will get a $10,000 bonus or they might get a $20,000 bonus, depending on how much they make in their salary. You do fly free. A bunch of people ask me that in every airline video I do. Yes, you fly free on any open seat and your dependents do too, meaning your children will fly free and your spouse will also fly free. I'm not too sure about like if parents fly free. I know for like Delta, your parents fly free, but I'm not sure about Southwest. You do get a 9.3% 401k match, which is huge and all those good old benefits, right? So if you have that experience in Agile, you've ever worked as a product owner, you've got any of that Microsoft Power Platform, PowerShell scripting experience, apply. Okay. Even if you are fresh out of college, you should be applying. Okay. Now the next position that we have is going to be for a software engineer, specifically Salesforce. A lot of you may have used Salesforce, whether you worked in like sales um, maybe you worked in another administrative position. You could have worked in professional services, but Salesforce is another one of those big CRMs that isn't just used for like ticketing. It could be used for so many other different, um, platforms. Like, um, you can track tickets. You can look up customers in it. Um, you can track revenue reports with Salesforce. So a lot of you have that experience already. So Salesforce is a very big thing, but basically what it says is is you're gonna to respond to production problems and implement immediate resolutions across those technology areas. So software engineers, you all know this different language as far as like having to write or be able to um, write in different codes and things of that nature. So we won't get into those details, but just wanted to point out that they are looking for someone with DevOps experience, those DevOps uh, tools. So make sure if you have DevOps experience, you're calling that out in the resume. Yes, I have resumes available for this job already, but in case you're just using your own resume, I just wanted to point out that is one big thing that's obviously going to be a very big hot word, okay? Um, also some AWS knowledge would be nice and Salesforce because the role is specifically for sales, uh, Salesforce. And when it comes to the salary for this job, this is also going to be a six figure job that's going to start at about 113,000 up to 125,000, depending on your experience, background, and that sort of stuff. Same benefits, you fly free, your wife and your kids fly free all that good stuff. So let me know if you all have any questions. Again, I just want to remind you super quickly, the September surge live Q and a is happening here on YouTube. This is going to take place on Sunday, September 24th at 9 PM Eastern. So go ahead and set your reminders. You can click on the link down in the description box and it'll give you the option to um, set the notify me reminder on that video. And let me know in the comments that you're going to be there. Like, I need to know how many of you are showing up so I can make sure this is like worth it. Okay. So let me know if you will be on the live Q and A and until then I will see you all in the next video. Bye.